Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are a PUBG mobile player, you have probably seen this annoying error. Server is busy, please try again later. Error code, restrict area. It's super frustrating, but don't worry. I've got a brand new trick that works on both iOS and Android to fix this error easily. This method is updated for 2024, so no matter when you are watching, it should still help. Plus, I will updating this video twice a month with a new code and new solutions. So make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also join my Telegram channel for all latest updates. A stick around to the end for some bonus tips and avoiding this error in the future. Let's jump in and get you back to the game. First of all, we will start with Android user. Uh, so go to your Play Store and search for DNS Changer, as you can see. And uh, guys, be patient. The app developer should be App Azo, as you can see here. App Azo is the developer. So download it and then open up it. Now wait a couple of seconds until the loading is completely. And after that, here guys, you can see two fields, uh, actually for fill some, uh, actually number. So we will type with each other 78.157.42.101. Now for second fields, uh, try to fill this number, 74. Point uh, 178.42 point, point, and 108. Now after that you finish your typing, just tap on a start, got it, and wait. Till C, connecting is, change it to connected. Uh, which is, actually means everything is okay, and we will uh, open up the PUBG mobile game. Now, as you can see, connection is uh, actually successfully. Now, uh, actually, Close the DNS changer and go to your uh, PUBG Mobile app. Now wait to see the loading and show you it works perfectly. 100% guys, uh, which is actually good with low lag, low latency and very fast. Now as you can see guys, the game is open it and you can go to your actually PUBG Mobile game and uh, playing and enjoying. Now, uh, in the next, I will actually teach you for iOS user which is the best one. Now wait and see the uh, iOS version. For the iOS user, guys, like Android user, go to your App Store, try search for DNS Override. As you can see, DNS Override. Now try to search and that's it guys as you can see dns all right with the red icon uh, just tap on get and try to download it after the app is completely downloaded open it after open up your app you may see a number of dns profile by default but we have nothing to do with them so look for the actually add profile section or add dns so here I found the add DNS profile, so just need to tap on it. And here on the profile name, you can use, for example, PUBG Mobile or whatever you want. So here I will type PUBG Mobile. And on your DNS type, guys, you, may, you might have actually three sections. Uh, which are DNS, DNS over HTTPS or DNS over TLS. We just actually use DNS, not another one. So after that, we will go to DNS servers, which actually need to type uh, our DNS server code. So here you need to type exactly the code like me. Now type on your phone 78.157.42. Two, 
point one hundred and one. Now tap on DNS server again to tap actually uh, DNS server two. Again, try to type seventy four point one hundred and seventy eight point forty two point one hundred and eight. Now just tap on done and we are finished here. So guys, be sure to turn on your DNS just like this uh, beside the actually server and here you can turn on or turn off your DNS. As you can see just uh, on the front of DNS override. Now it's time to open up your PUBG player and test the DNS, which is so great with low lag, low latency and great just guys uh, be with me and we will test it with each other well as you can see guys uh, we enter to the game without any errors or any problem now let me show you the actually game speed and ping test of the pubg mobile with this actually great dns just wait a couple of the seconds and i will show you on the pre-match well, great guys, as you can see, my ping is about 72, 76, or even uh, on the maximum, actually 80, which is so great for the game and register your bullets. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this trick helped you uh, for fix, actually, server is busy error. And remember, I will updating this video twice a month with the latest codes and solutions. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay update. Also join my telegram channel for even faster updates. If you have any question or need further help, drop a comment below and I will do my best to assist you. So see you soon in the next video.